an international rock band began searching for a new lead singer. Australia's In Excess teamed up with TV producer Mark Burnett to launch a worldwide search for their replacement. Amongst the thousands of auditioners was a young man from Oakville, Ontario named J.D. Fortune. J.D. was a product of a number of small bands in Ontario, including Midnight Marilyn and Juice, before vying for a once-in-a-lifetime opportunity to be the front man of one of the world's most popular bands, In Excess, as they attempted to relaunch a new album with a new lead singer appropriately named Switch. public react. J.D. Fortune. <laughs> that really has nothing to do with it. No. I'm more excited to see the band yeah, itself. Sure. I'm, yeah. I don't really care about J.D. <laughs> yeah. We're here to come watch them because we watched the show two years ago and it was so much fun. Well, you know what? He's doing a way great job, actually. <laughs> I think he's even better, but <laughs> hopefully it won't end like the previous guy, but it's good. Through the course of the rock star in excess competition, J.D. struggled to live and work with those that he was competing against. After a rocky start, however, J.D. found a groove and began to become a fan favorite as well as a favorite of the judges, a role held by the members of in excess. <laughs> Finding a delicate balance between enhancing the classic tunes of In Excess that fans have grown to love, while adding a certain spice that only J.D. could. If rock stars are a step away from the edge, J.D. had found his. If I hope yeah. he does a good job. I hope he can pull off the classic. Yeah, they have. <laughs> Hopefully they play the old stuff. Yeah, that would be fun. That's what I'm about to see. Yeah. It's not new. Not new In Excess. It's not the old In Excess. To look at the circumstances facing J.D.'s future, he is attempting to replace a rock icon of the 80s and 90s, winning the role as a reality TV contestant. Is he pop star material or popcorn fantasy? The verdict is still out on that question, but for now, J.D. Fortune is living a dream. Lots of 